a five-year-old boy who survived a terrifying car accident caught on surveillance cameras may never walk again. The boy was crossing the street with his older sister and a cousin earlier this month when they were hit by a speeding car. Tonight, those young women are telling their story. We warn you, this video is graphic and may be difficult for some to watch. Here's Paul Bieben. It is a horrifying moment. Two young women and a boy sent flying. When I saw the lights, like, right before my eyes, and I remember the car hitting me on my right side of my pelvis. That's 18-year-old Carla Mendoza. You can see her in front of the car somehow getting up. Her 20-year-old cousin, Jackie Velazquez, flung into the other lane, lies crumpled, unconscious. But what you cannot see is Carla's little brother, Jonathan, pinned under the front bumper. No, I don't think I can see my cousin in the eyes, you know, because I caused her this pain. The three were walking home after getting ice cream and playing in the park. The women say they looked both ways and that they thought the car would stop. At the last second, you can see them grab Jonathan and brace for impact. That was so close, but it's not your time yet. Just live. Amazingly, all three survived. Carla and Jackie are home, recovering from internal injuries and broken bones. But days after the accident, Jonathan can't move his legs and remains in the hospital with major spinal injuries. I feel like I caused my little brother this pain, you know. I only wanted him, you know, to go out and enjoy and have fun at the park. He was set to start kindergarten in the fall. His family says he'll need months of therapy, but they're hopeful. He's wiggling his toes and smiling, eager to go home. Donations are pouring into a GoFundMe site to help pay for Jonathan's treatment and hopefully get this beloved little boy back on his feet. People in this Oakland neighborhood say this intersection is notoriously dangerous. They want the city to put up signs and flashing lights. One official says that should be a no brainer. Now, Elaine, this was not a hit and run. The driver did stop and get out and Jackie and Carla are wishing him well. Terrifying video. Paul Beban, thanks so much.